We're making a bridesmaid bouquet with some sunflowers. We've got three sunflowers here. Um, some pink limonium. Pink status also works really well. We've got about two stems here. About two or three stems is ideal. Um, we have some burlap to wrap it all up. You're gonna need some pins, some corsage pins to pin the burlap on. Floral tape to keep all the flowers together and some scissors to cut the stems once you're done. You're gonna need about um, 12 inches I would say um, for whatever flowers, greens, anything else that you're using. Um, you're gonna want to cut it to that so it's easier to arrange. So we're gonna take the sunflowers and um, as you can see they have a little bit of a natural tilt to their head and it's easier, easiest to just work with that and kind of put them all back to back to back so they give you a nice beautiful showing of all of their heads. Um, this is going to be a bridesmaid bouquet again so it's going to be a little bit smaller which is why we only have about three stems of sunflower. I'm going to take some limonium, just kind of place it towards the middle and then you can kind of pull it through wherever you want it to stick out. If it's sticking out a little too much, don't worry about it. You can always trim some of it off after. Put another stem in there. Make sure it kind of comes around on the sides as well. Anything down here you can just kind of get rid of. sticking out. You can just kind of trim off so it's not too much out there. We're gonna floral tape all the stems together now that we have it all nicely wrapped. You're gonna want to pull a decent size off. Cut it beforehand because you're going to want to hold it down and pull. It kind of like gets a little lighter in color you can see. It only really wraps to itself so you're definitely going to want to make sure to keep on that floral tape. Just start higher up because you're going to cut the stems as well so as high up as you can and just kind of up and pull at the same time and then push down and there you go. Now we're going to cover the floral tape up with a little bit of burlap. All you have to do is start up where the floral tape starts and it's easiest to give it pin to secure it. You're just going to want to stick it through one of the little pieces on the top and another one at the bottom. Kind of find where the burlap intersects if you're using burlap just to secure it in and then go ahead and wrap it around a few times. into place. Make sure you're not pinning up or down. You don't want to pin through because it's going to come out the other side. Give it about three pins. So one at the bottom, one in the middle, and one at the top. And then you're going to want to just give it a little cut to the stems, anything that's left over, however you want it to be. It's usually about an inch or two left at the bottom. 